In this video, I'm going to introduce you to our two TradingView indicators based on our Power Law model. They can be accessed by subscribing to one of our Patreon plans. The Adaptive Power Law Fitting model can be accessed by subscribing to our Berserker tier, and if you subscribe to our Rocket Scientist tier, you will also gain access to our Bitcoin Power Law Spirals indicator. You can choose to use one or the other, however, the two indicators are the most effective when combined. But before I show you how to set them up, I will give you a brief overview of what the indicators actually show. If you just want to see how to set the indicators up, feel free to just skip ahead to that part of the video. So, there are different ways to visualize our power law model. For example, you could show it traditionally as a log log chart, or you could just visualize it as a spiral, which can be even more useful. Power law spirals are used all the time, and these patterns can even be found in nature. To make a circular chart, you just need two things. Theta, which is time normalized to an angle, and the radius, which is the price. When looking at the spiral model, think of it as an analog clock. I know many youngsters don't know how to read one these days, but besides being able to read the clock on your grandma's wall, it is also a very useful skill to have if you want to understand our charts. So think of each Bitcoin cycle as a day on this clock with the only difference being that one day is 12 hours instead of 24 hours on this clock. Thus, every day is just one rotation around the clock, which in Bitcoin's case is four years. Bottoms generally happen close to three o'clock. Transitions from a bearish trend to a much more bullish one happen by six o'clock, and the bull markets turn into a frenzy at nine o'clock. Market cycle peaks generally happen close to 12 o'clock. The blue line shows the price action as it happens. The red hand is the current time, and it also intersects the price action of previous cycles to have an easy view of what the price was doing then. This is aided by the dotted circles, which indicate price. Bitcoin halvings, on the other hand, are indicated by the orange circles. Finally, the white line shows what Bitcoin should be doing in general according to the power law. If the price was more constant, this chart would look like a circle instead of a spiral. Gold, for example, looks more like a circle because its price is very stable. But Bitcoin is making a spiral because the radius is becoming bigger and bigger due to the rapidly increasing price. A black hole, on the other hand, would become smaller and smaller. This very similar chart here projects Bitcoin's price even further into the future and predicts Bitcoin reaching $1 million by 2034 or so. We greatly appreciate all of your support, so our live spiral chart is available for everyone to see as a sign of our gratitude. The link can be found in the description. Now to the indicators. The Adaptive Power Law Trading View Indicator is relatively straightforward and has a series of ribbons to indicate how much we differ from the general trend, which is the blue line. If the price is above this line, Bitcoin becomes a bit overvalued, and once it reaches the red line, it really needs to cool off, so it could be a good idea to sell or make smaller DCA purchases depending on your strategy. On the other hand, the purple line shows when Bitcoin is extremely undervalued, and it is pretty good at catching market cycle bottoms. We also have white triangles indicating Bitcoin halvings, and a future projection here for the next halving. The adaptive power law indicator closely resembles this chart of ours, with the main difference being that the trading view price action is displayed in a log linear fashion instead of the slightly more informative log log way. Creating a power law spiral chart on trading view is even more unrealistic due to the platform's limitations, so Giovanni has created a very clever workaround. This is where our second indicator comes in. Instead of being projected as a spiral, the price action is unraveled into a sine wave pattern using the methodology in this video. However, the cusps of the waves don't go negative because this could mislead some people into believing that they indicate price drops. Instead, they are a bit more nuanced. Every other cusp does indicate a price decline, but the rest of them indicate transitions to the frenzy phase of the bull market. Similarly, the tops of the curves alternate between bull market tops and transitions from bear to bull markets. Does this sound familiar? Let me visualize it for you. 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 9 o'clock, and finally 12 o'clock again. Finally, the difference between these two lines is that the red one is the normal power law model and the yellow one is the full model 
which projects tops and bottoms. Now let's set the trading view indicators up. So once you've subscribed to one of our tiers here on Patreon, for example from BTC, Powerlaw, Berserker and up, you can then go to our Discord server. Here you should join the TV Signal signup channel and post your trading view username. We will then add you to our indicators. So once we've added you to one of our indicators, go to trading view and click on your profile icon over here. Make sure to enable dark mode because it looks best with our indicators. After that, make sure you're using the correct BTC chart. So in our case, we want to use the Bitcoin all-time history index. This gives us the most accurate data possible because it goes back all the way to Bitcoin's creation, it has the longest uh, price history of Bitcoin that is available on TradingView. So now that we see this chart over here, we want to enable logarithmic mode from this gear icon over here. Okay. After that, we want to click on the daily chart because this is what our indicators use. Mm -hmm. Now, after this, you want to go to indicators and go to invite only scripts. So you can search for our two indicators here. And once you've found them, you can favorite them. Don't worry if you can't find them. Sometimes TradingView has a glitch, so you might want to refresh your page. But once you've been invited, you can go to this invite only scripts, search for indicators, and you should be able to find them. So after that, you can go to favorites and click on one of the indicators. So let's click on this one over here. It might take a few seconds. Mm -hmm. As you can see, we have the fitting chart, power law fitting. Now, if we want to add the other indicator, we can go back to favorites and click on BTC power law spirals. Now we have the other indicator here. Don't they look nice? So we've set them up. And we're hoping to see you soon in a future video or hopefully on our Discord server. Thanks for watching.